40th Avenue in Hudsonville will never be looked upon the same again. All because of an accident between man and animal. We were coming north on 40th here, and as we approached this creek, a deer came running up. I braked and I swerved, but there was no way I could miss them. At the same time, opposite direction on 40th Avenue. All of a sudden, I seen a deer run up out of, out of the creek, and I saw it coming. And then uh, the truck coming this, uh, going the other direction, hit it. It pushed the deer uh, right into my path, and I tried to stop, and there's just no way. It came so fast, and I ended up just riding right over it. There was a lot of sound, a, a thump. It was a good thud. Enough for the two teens riding in this golf cart to come to a halt. And we walked up on it, and the thing was still alive a little bit, lifting up its head, trying to breathe and stuff. You know, it was in bad shape, and all of a sudden it started moving. And, and it was like, what was that? And after the second movement, we realized there was a baby falling in there to be born. One of the kids says, hey, uh, who's got a knife? I Looked, felt around the stomach for the right place to cut, find out where it was, and found some skin where I can cut into the sack where it was in. Started cutting it, saw its legs, grabbed a hold of its legs, and pulled it out. A few seconds later, out of death came life. <laughs> and that was awesome to see it breathe for the first time. That's a miracle. A picture worth so many words, the human touch worth so much more. A fawn in the hands of its rescuers once again. <laughs> <laughs> Even though a reminder of a life loss still scars this truck, some might say it's a birthmark of sorts. It all depends on how you look at it, knowing a fawn is looking back. <laughs> it's precious. It's amazing.